This is a gentleman who I worked with his daughter and he was on his way to being referred to a vascular surgeon because he had 100% occlusion of his left carotid artery and about 50% occlusion of his right carotid artery. So here we have again, there is his almost, a, you know, 50% occluded internal carotid artery on the right. And we'll go here to the left. Now here is his totally occluded carotid artery on the left. We're going to work to reverse his disease because he's completely asymptomatic. And I think many people might be shocked to learn that this isn't a surgical problem. This is a medical lifestyle problem. Should have a medical and lifestyle solution to reverse his disease. So, you know, we utilize that information to provoke action. This is our quantitative test. This is the, you know, the, one of the types of reports that Ford's been talking about for, for CIMT, but the ability to deliver this initial imaging on the spot on the go has just been a game changer. And then the other technology we use, I, I mentioned it earlier, is body composition analysis. So we have the Embody 570, call it the Judge. This is actually a home version of you can purchase uh, on Amazon. The point is it gives us the kind of data and feedback that allows us to get really into the details. And we use visceral fat level as a surrogate marker for insulin resistance. So if, if a patient has a visceral fat level of over 10, we presume that they're insulin resistant and then work with them to try to bring that visceral fat level down. Ford's been preaching all along. It's really about, our, our mantra is, can you cut out sweets, including artificial sweeteners, starches, and snacks for the next two weeks and come back and see, reoriented my language from calling it the judge. That's the first step. From then on, it becomes the coach. The idea is that we want to put the patient in a program where they get personal training or coaching. I think many of the tools that you provide allow people to do it yourself version of it but let's face it at some point we all kind of get stuck and if we can access it i think the next stage that you're offering when they become a patient is you become their personal coach their personal trainer and that's where you see the best results because then you get down into some of the things that they may not have thought about or overlooked and we see it all the time in our patients as we go through their checklist